you guys have dates yet? No. 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 Nah. No. Tonight's the dance. I'm a little worried. Um, uh, I was thinking Morgan was going to ask me, but I have a feeling she's going to ask Will. And I'm really freaking out. Guys, we're going to go find some advice, figure out how to get girls to ask us for this dance, alright? Yeah. 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 Excuse me, miss? Yes? I need help. Can I sit here? Sure, absolutely. Um, how do I get a girl to ask me to the dance? Well, I was watching TV the other night, and I saw this great commercial, you have to smell really good. So maybe chocolate axe. Chocolate axe. Thank you so much. <laughs> Question. How do you get a date to Sadie Hawkins? How could I get a date to the Sadie Hawkins? A date? Well, first of all, you're gonna have to start working out. Ooh. And then, well, I guess you're gonna have to buy her some gojis. Some gojis. Hi, so um I've never really asked a guy to a dance, so I was kinda wondering how you kind of go about that type of thing. First off, you need eye protection. Because they might hit you right in the corneas. Instead of saying no, some guys have done this. They just drill you right in the eyeballs. Hey, Mr. Lusk. Oh, what's up, man? I'm looking to get a girl to ask me to do the Sadie Hawkins dance. Ah, good luck with that. <laughs> what should I do? Well, well, you can always play football. Sick joke, Mr. Lusk. <laughs> How should I ask the guy to dance? Well, I think that you should base your decision on the covalent bond. And, um, you know, if the covalent bond is non-polar, then if you ask him, he's probably going to say yes. Uh, what's your electronegativity? I'm a solid 2.2. What do you think his is? Maybe like a 2.4? That's a difference of point two. That's a non-polar bond. It's probably going to happen. Okay. Don't hesitate to ask them. Okay. All right. Summer's done it. How can we get a date to the dance? Well, as unlikely as that may be, I think your chances may be better if you eliminate all dangling Percivals. We don't like things that dangle too much. The other thing is you may want to get rid of those comma splices because, you know, splicing, depending right. on where it occurs, can be rather detrimental as well. And lastly, I think if you really want to hook a good one, is to start with a good hook, right? Mm -hmm. And then, once you hook them, it's all about the ending. A really solid closing that is clever and also has universal appeal. I've never asked a guy before, so I don't really know what to do. Do you have any advice? Well, I, I guess if we go back, you know, a couple thousand years to Plato, uh, in Plato's Allegory of the Cave, love really is just nothing but an illusion. So once you accept that, you'll be able to do it in any way you see fit. Um, you know, as Morpheus said, you know, is that air you're breathing? Well, the way I want you to think about it is, is he actually ask, going to say yes to me? Is that dating that you're going to be doing or dancing? Understand? Yes. All right. Well, the Sadie Hawkins dance is coming up, but I don't know how to ask a guy. What do guys oh. like? How do I ask them? Well, Janelle, that's pretty simple. Uh, have you ever seen the, the commercial uh, where the woman shows up in the bar and she's got a purse full of bacon and the fresh smell of bacon is wafting? Oh, yeah. If you show up, pick your guy, you show up with a nice baconator from Wendy's and say, would you like to go to the Sadie Hawkins dance with me? Perfect, no problem. Yeah, they'll be hooked. Okay, sure. I'll do that. I heard they're asking younger guys. I heard they're gonna have their own sister Hawkins. That's so ratchet. I ordered my khakis off for Mary. Most of the grad girls would talk to us. Guess the grade nines are cuter then. If the girls get their hair done in salons, do we go too? Why don't we just ask younger guys? Yeah, they can't resist an older woman. Mm-hmm. I hope someone asked me. Me too. Me too.